What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Creighton 3, otherwise known as the Avatar Bishop X, bringing you today some smite footage. I've been very much enjoying this 3 versus 3. And um, I haven't been uh, changing my playstyle that much. I do what I do. I like playing this Hercules. So I picked Herc, and these two guys decided to troll me and say that I was a new told them to take their tier list and stuff and shove it. And so then they got mad and decided to troll me. So this game will be funny. You'll notice that they will basically sit back and try not to attack. But I don't pay them much mind. I pretty much go one versus three most of the game. By the time my teammates decide to actually start helping out, I have already had so much of a lead. Uh, I don't know if they were good or not. They might have been pretty good players. They were just so busy trying to troll me and see me die. Or maybe they were just bad and they weren't trolling. But I mean, you missed the whole conversation that went on before this. When they started uh, just acting up and chatting, I just said, I gotta turn on the recorder. This is gonna be too funny. But um, let me talk a little about the build that I normally use. Um, I really like Hercules's uh, three. It basically will return, it will heal you over time and return a portion of the damage that you take during the time period of time. Once maxed out, it will return more damage than you take. So wait till you know you're gonna take damage, activate it. Works even better when you use it with a cooldown reduction. Because of the cooldown reduction that I get from, oh, I don't know, Breastplate of Valor. Not only will you now have a lot of mana, but you can pretty much keep it up indefinitely once you get Breastplate of Valor and the cooldown reduction from Boots. So I pretty much keep it up end game at all times. This game started out, I took Watcher's Gift, which Your lets you take uh, late last hit XP and money bonus. Uh, and I bought Midas Boots and Med. So I was being called a noob because I took Watcher's Gift, I took Hercules, and only noob to his med. That may be what they say on the websites of phones, but it really depends on your game type and what character you're playing with. I mean, Hercules, your hit points and sustainability are based around how much mana you have. So basically what I do is I take med all the way up to get the self heal. So now you're this big lumbering mound of I heal myself with my mana and I heal myself my mana and my hit points with med. It's a non-stop you know, non-stop hit points. You can become almost non-killable. You don't kill that much. Well, you kill a fair amount. What really messed me up was this last patch where they decided to uh, take away Ankh. What I used to do was I would load up on heavy hit point items uh, and then Eye of Retaliation. So with the old Eye of Retaliation, what I would do was I would uh, use a lot of high hit point items like uh, Frostbound Hammer and... What was it? Frostbound Hammer, uh, Ankh of the Golem. So Ankh of the Golem was adding attack power for as much hit points as I had. But the Eye of Retaliation worked the same as Hercules' uh, passive. So basically, I would take a lot of damage, pop my three, let my 
hit points go all the way down to critical. Then I would throw my ult and see 800s, 900s, and 1000s popping up all over the screen and just repeat the process because I would heal back to 90% life from critical. It's pretty funny. Um, so yeah, now we're getting back into the action. We're building up a little bit more. As you can see, um, in my opinion, I don't know how it worked in Dota. I don't know how it worked in League of Legends. But to me, for this game, anybody can get kills with any spec. I've seen people tell me that Ymir was bad and shouldn't be trying to deal damage and shouldn't be in the jungle. And I even laughed myself. This dude went out, got 19 kills at one death. I saw somebody play a Freya as a tank. <laughs> yeah, he just can't be a tank. This man died one time in a conquest match. I know there are limits to some things, but I think I've seen all in this game. You'll see how I do in this game. I'm playing a tank spec and doing a good job of getting fed and getting kills. To me, this game, especially this game mode, is all about how much time you spend in the lane. Like, for some reason, I get guys who want to spend like five minutes in the base and then run off and jungle. I mean, the jungle buffs don't do enough for you in this game type for me to want to run off and go in the jungle all the time. I basically want to stay in lane and soak up that XP. Stay alive as long as possible. I think that's the biggest difference uh, in this game other than these two trying to troll me is that I sat here with Watcher's Gift on and soaked up all the lane XP. So everybody's last hit, I'm getting it. The XP, the money... And then I use Midas boots, so I was really weak in the beginning of the game, but towards the end of the game, I just had a ton of cash. So I out-leveled, out-farmed, and out-geared, and outlasted everybody. Be careful, middle. But even here, I'm trying to let them know. I'm like, I'm going back to base. You guys be careful. They're like, shut up. All right. But it's funny, so as soon as I leave, I go to go back to the lane, and I'm they're both going to get caught in an ult. They both got out of it, but, you know, they almost got exploded upon by, uh, if Poseidon had been a little bit quicker. See, right here, boom, the trap in the ult. Be careful, middle. Poseidon had been a second quicker. That would be disastrous for both of them. But I mean, love how much single target here. Hercules dishes out. Uh, one of my favorite kind of openings is oh, I to this I it. ricocheting these boulders. The boulder will stay active for quite some time. So if you can hit somebody with your initial push in throwing the ult, it can ricochet off the wall and then hit them again. It's just deadly. Defend middle lane! Your middle tower. Well, I don't know what more I could say about this build. This is going to be a rather long video. And this is just about the part where I start to take over. So I'll let you all view the rest of the video for yourself. I thank you all for watching. I thank you all for listening. Hopefully, I'll see you all on the battlefield. Take care. Thanks. Be careful, middle.
incoming. Enemies incoming. Boom! Enemy coming through! An ally has been slain. Have slain an enemy. That's too bad. Ultimate is ready. Ultimate is ready. Ultimate is ready. Wait. Okay. Your middle no. tower is under attack. Too bad. Be right back. Okay. Incoming. An ally has been slain. You have our enemies. 
I'll defend middle lane. Ah! <sighs> 